right folks how y'all doing today today is wednesday i believe it's easy to lose track of the days when you're on a cruise ship we in bar harbor maine y'all i'm good for not letting y'all know how the food tastes when we eat at a restaurant yesterday i think i left y'all at the restaurant i didn't close off the video everything we had was pretty good except but the drink i didn't drink mine i took a couple sips it was i think it was something with that pineapple the pineapple wasn't given and it was throwing the whole drink off so hopefully here in bar harbor i can find a good drink or maybe in canada we got a nova scotia canada tomorrow and then halifax i think it's halifax and then halifax then we got a sea day then we'll be headed back to new york i was gonna say home the trip was so last minute i booked two days i don't know if i told y'all yet but i booked two days before we were set to sail we had to fly in the same day that the ship was set to sail and i normally would not do that that's like pushing it to me because just anything could go wrong y'all that guy don't know how much of a blessing he was at that airport at our airport that line for just to check in your bags was ridiculous tsa was more than what it say 15 to 17 minutes it was it was a lot longer because the systems went down we would have definitely missed our flight once we got through tsa they were already boarding we were two minutes late past the boarding time because they do tell you to be there two hours early we got there an hour early the bike ride yesterday was fun and funny it was this old guy that had me cracking up the whole time he was so impatient and he was complaining about everything it was so funny first of all he was complaining about the tour guides talking too much i'm like did he not know that this was a tour he was complaining about stopping too much and he was complaining about them talking too much <laughs> The first time he said something, we stopped at the um, we stopped at some bathrooms. So he's standing next to us and he's talking to Cleveland. He's like, man, he talked too much. And he rides slow. <laughs> and it's funny because he was the one doing all that complaining and he the one almost veered off on the side of the freaking off a cliff or something. <laughs> I looked up, this fool was, we all supposed to be going straight, right? This fool was a <laughs> The next time he said something, we was at the light. And then he, the guy was telling us about some, some restaurant, some family owned restaurant. So the guy like, yeah, yeah. We had stopped at a pier. He's like, yeah, I got a reservation at six. We need to be heading back. So as we leave in the pier, the guy was like, turn left. We came from the right. The old guy was like, we supposed to be turning right. <laughs> it was other stuff that he was saying and doing. I just can't remember right now. I have to ask Cleveland. But that dude had me cracking up. But anyway, the whole tour was nice. It was, oh, this one lady failed. She fell off her bike. <laughs> and I can laugh now because she did. Well, I was laughing then in my head. Because, I mean, she we wasn't riding the bike. It, we were just getting on the bikes. We hadn't even started yet. We were just getting on the bikes. And I guess she was trying to adjust. I don't know. She was real wobbly. Like I said, she hadn't pedaled and moved anywhere. And she just, what she did, she moved a couple inches and just fell over. This one lady was like, can you even ride a bike? <laughs> it was funny. Do you remember any other thing that that old man was saying? He was asking the guys. He was like, are we going to do this much talking on the way back? <laughs> Because he didn't want to stop nowhere. He almost maybe going to that car. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. My heart skipped a beat. Cleveland was riding in front of me. The old dude was riding in front of Cleveland. And then it was the guy. guy. Yeah, and it was the guy. So what he do? Stop or? He slammed on his brakes. Like, <laughs> but we was going over the. the overpass. Yeah, like we like was going thing. over the overpass. And it was, in the street. It was, it was and cars, cars is and right just, next to us. He just braked right in front of me. So I hit the brakes and it. I was only riding with one hand because I had the phone in my other hand. I was filming. No. Oh. And then when I when I the brake I had to press was the left one, which is the front. Uh -huh. So it made the bike swerve over. Oh. Yeah, so it just swerved over, and I couldn't grab it. I couldn't stabilize. I only had one hand on the bike. Cause I looked up and next thing I know, Cleveland was like this close to the side of the car. In the street somewhere. <laughs> like what the heck? I ain't on his brakes, like what are you doing? The other guy, he didn't even stop. The guy didn't stop, he just stopped. Oh. He almost fell too, remember? 
He did? Yeah, oh, he you did. talking about when he over went meant over? No. Oh, it was another time. No, I'm talking about him when he was all wobbling. He almost right. He that's what I was telling them. And then at one point when we were coming back, he was behind me, and you can just hear him like just saying little stuff. Remember. Yeah, complaining under his breath. I was just <laughs> man, I was rolling. To the bathroom the first time. Huh? When they went to the bathroom the first time when we was on our way there, he didn't want them to stop. I know. Right? I, that's why I said he came over and started talking to you. So when we got back off of the bike riding tour, we had about three hours left to kind of tour the town or whatever. Maybe Maybe less, a little bit less than three hours. So we went back to the porthole, the restaurant that we ate at the first time. I got a lobster dinner, some clam strips. The clam strips was a little funny. I didn't really like them. They were dark. So I'm not sure if they were different kind of clams because I'm not used to clam strips so dark like that. It was real like gamey. So today we got an excursion for Arcadia National Park and some other um, sightseeing stuff and of course i'm gonna get some more lobster but anyway let me finish getting ready and i'll pick y'all back up once we get off of this ship so we are on our tender boat that's what it looks like i should have showed y'all what the outside looks like but look at the driver right up here they would use this boat in the case of an emergency too, right? So they got the life jackets under the seats. So we in a little town. Everything's closed though. We went into the information center or the visitor center and they had like, you know how they have all the pamphlets? Everything said closed for the season because this is the last cruise of the season. And <laughs> just like our Alaskan cruise, the last cruise of the season. That's why they both were so cheap. They let us off right dead smack in their little town. So we about to head back to the ship. Cause it's nothing to do, y'all. It's a big um it's a restaurant right here. Not open. Yeah. Gifts and home decor. P Penelope's gifts and home decor. Ain't open. Oh, yes. Oh, this jewelry store is open though. It's a hotel right here. Kind of windy out here. It's low tide right now. In the spring and summer, this is full of water. The lobster restaurant right here. But like I said, everything is closed. St. John's Bay, Canada. I'm coming back to the room to get my phone because I left it. About to head off of the ship where we were headed off of the ship. It's a little late because we kind of slept in and kind of chilled because we've been going port after port after port after port with no sea days. So we kind of chilled in the room. It's about a little bit after one. The boat leaves at 5.30, but I don't think it's much to do out there. Yesterday, they little town closed up shop on us. Let's see. I don't even know what I did with it. Where is it? It's on the bed. It's not there. Oh, it's on the bed. Okay, let's head out. Head back out. <laughs> Gotta walk all the way to the front of the boat to the casino. This is like the little um, 18 and up club it's called Bliss. Oh, 
Huh? All right, so as soon as we come out of like the visitor center thing, you gotta pass through that when you get off of the boat. It's like these little shipping containers, they didn't turned into little boutiques and stores. We'll probably check those out on the way back. Go see what's out here on the streets. We don't have an excursion, obviously, because most of the excursions were, um, I don't know, something we weren't interested in. We're on our way to this um, lobster or seafood restaurant. It says a four minute walk this way, but basically just look like, you know, any other downtown. But we about to head in this uh, candy store. Can we even bring this back on the ship? <laughs> Look, look like they got all the candy you can think of. See if they got any uh, cigarettes. <laughs> Y'all seen these before? Skittle, Chewies, no shell. I think I'm gonna try They got another. Oh, these, oh, these are the giants. I'm bringing this back to Naya. Cause we was, so she seen somebody on TikTok trying these and we couldn't find them. So I'm gonna bring, I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna bring one back to Naya and I'm gonna try these. To get peach. Great. These look cute. Rainbow drops. What are they though? Canada, are y'all okay with these heels? This heels up all up and down this downtown. Billy Seafood. We gotta go through this market though. Oops. Right. We could have walked through this market. We walked on in the back. Okay, Billy's. The waiter and it was another um, older gentleman came over with the waters. Super nice. So sweet. But the lobster roll. That's what I'm talking about. I like it toasted and buttered and toasted on the outside. Then I got a seafood chowder, which has all kind of seafood in it. Oh, I got a whole muscle in here. And then Cleveland got mozzarella and salad. And he already tasted lobster roll. He said it's good. It's better than the other lobster roll that we yeah, tried. The, the bun is what do it. Mm -hmm. I mean, the lobster is real sweet too. Yeah. But the butter is what, the buttery it, roll is what do it. Without that, that other one was like a hot dog bun. Like I said, like <laughs> hot dog bun with a, a little bit of butter. So I, <laughs> you know, like an extra large ballpark bun. Like, <laughs> so, yeah. you, so I always exaggerate the well, ballpark bun. It was dry, it was dry, it wasn't even butter. <laughs> but the lobster was really good, y'all. That was some of the best, freshest lobster that I've tasted. Mm -hmm. Definitely was on the point with that. Yeah, difference. but the roll. That's why I gave it a four and a half out of five stars because of the um, roll. Y'all yeah, just asked the waiter if I can get some of the crackers. She was like, we don't have a single cracker in the restaurant. But she was like, let me go see if one of my friends across the hall has some. What? Where did where you where get that kind of service from? She actually, she actually left out of the door. <laughs> So we're gonna see if she come back with some. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Oysters, but the uh -huh. laser crackers. Yes, thank, thank you. you. I, I really appreciate it. I Jeremiah, so they're all clean and promised. Okay. They're, they're real good girls. All right, thank, thank you. you. I really you. appreciate all it. Right. <laughs> he about to go throw a piece of a donut on the ground, probably, so he can make the birds fly off. <laughs> he did it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Only Cleveland, y'all. I wish I had some chips. I'd crumble them up and just throw them. And then all of them would get some. But that bread can't really. That donut got to be gone by now. No, they still scratching. Look, right there. Pieces. Yeah, it's gone because they're scattering. They're leaving. Yo, be free, my girl. <laughs> be free. I guess they don't feel like flying. This is one of the bases right off of the um, cruise ship port here. These uh, beaver tails. I just got the classic cinnamon and sugar. 
Yeah, this is just like an elephant ear. The uh, older lady, she says she eat this all the time. She described it as a waffle, but nah. This is definitely an elephant ear. Mm. It's good. Happy Friday. Today we will be in Halifax, Canada. It's 9.03. We're supposed to arrive by 11. But I was going to order room service. My hubby went down there and got the stuff for me because he was like, you can say that a 9.95 service fee. I got some fruit and some boiled eggs. You see this? We walked a good, but three, four blocks straight up a hill. And now we about to walk up these stairs and then walk up another hill to see what's up here. Shoot, I was like, we, we up here now. We did all that walking up the hill. Might as well continue to see the water down there. Our boat obviously is that way, but I think we're a lot farther down to the right. We've been walking a good minute. Halifax Citadel. All right. We ain't even. Uh, all right, we got this flight to go. Then we got a, another hill. Yay. Oh, I thought that was him yelling. No, oh, they inside of the thing. <laughs> I thought that was one of them yelling. They be acting funny here about recording. So I asked Cleveland, I said, if I start recording them, are they going to shoot me? Uh, are you good? Hi. Basically, they just did a whole bunch of yelling. Are they still yelling? <laughs> but um, this is what it looks like up here. Y'all, yeah, we done found the uh, Urban Outfitters. More stairs, more stairs. I like this hat. I like this, I like this color, 29. Uh, when they start selling North Face in here? <laughs> now you got that Hello Kitty shirt. <laughs> I don't love you anymore. That sucks. That really sucks. I like the shirt though. <laughs> I mean, I like, you know how the colors are? I get it. I, the don't anymore is kind of blacked out so you don't really see it. It's blended in with the black. I love you. Okay, I, I dig it, I dig it. Y'all probably caught that in the beginning. I did. But yeah, I'm not paying $45 for the shirt though. This is what the fives look like. They money looks sweet, don't it? We just need to see what the 10 and the one. We ain't gonna see what the 50 look like. <laughs> I seen the 10, it was purple. Oh, okay. It was in the drawer. And the feel of it is like plastic. I feel like plastic. And this, this right here. Is this, oh, this $2. So now we gotta go in another store this to a spend dollar. a little bit so we can get a dollar back and see what this the dollar. This a dollar right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's not no no money no paper. no paper dollar. No, that's a dollar. All right, we headed down here to this pier. Y'all, I'm getting another beaver tail. I seen um. If it's open. It better be open. You gonna 
then in this way. No, are you gonna go up there and slide down? Oh, there it is. Right. Oh, Cleveland is closed. I'm a closed. It's not that cold out here, but my hands are cold because I just was drinking some um, water from Starbucks. But it's been a beautiful day today, like perfect weather. I didn't even need my oh, thank. <laughs> I didn't even need my jacket. Okay, so I know I want some lobster this time, but for lunch I didn't get lobster because I wanted it. In a dinner portion <laughs> so i just got those uh fish tacos which was okay the clam chowder from yesterday was better than the clam chowder today 